Salutation citizens, Jackman here, and we are back with Trainer Jackman in Pokemon Heart Gold. Now, I've had a request that I should put the levels of the Pokemon in the overlay on the right. If they're there, I've decided it's not annoying. If they're not there, this is my current team. So we have Raka the Bonsley is level 5. We have uh, the level 11 Tangy the Geodude. A level 4 Murphy the Cubone. Level 6 Bitey the Ponyta. Level 5 Filthy Dog the Dusclops. Forgot what you were called then. And a le I don't know what item you're holding. Salak Berry. Okay, fine. And a level 3 Martin the Spoink. Half my team are useless. This is where we are at the moment. Martin, Murphy and Raka have no offensive moves whatsoever. Um, yeah, it's not great. But, I mean, uh, they... They they must get better, so I'm just going to have to keep them out front and hope that I can level them. Um, also, we're going to have to save a lot more, because this game buggy as shit. So I'm going to try going to the Alpha Ruins again, because uh, that didn't work last time. Hopefully it will actually let me do stuff here. Um, I don't know what I can do here at this point, but... We shall see. Uh, I've also remapped my controls slightly, so it should be a bit easier. Okay, I don't, I don't think I, do, I think I can just not get in there. Can I go right? Okay, so it's, it's actually loading the map now, which is good. That is an improvement. This is a mysterious hall. Watch your step. Okay. Can I catch Pokemon here? I think this is the place where you normally catch unknown. I'm not sure. Well, that might be the wrong game. But I'm, I, I think this is the one. I don't care, because I mean, it'll be random. So whatever spawns here, maybe it'll be nothing. Frost. You're a, you're a useless woman. It has a quality. It's a replica of an ancient Pokemon. Which... Which ancient Pokemon is that exactly? Because it's not one I recognise. It looks like an... I don't know. What is that? Hmm, okay. I'm, I'm, I'm looking at it trying really hard thinking, is that an actual Pokemon or is it just a statue, a random statue? It might just be a random statue. Oh, there are Pokemon in this. Brilliant. All right, here we go. Ruins of Alpha, we've got... We've got a Taurus. Excellent. That's useless. Fuck, it's a Taurus. <laughs> God damn it. That's really bad. I mean... Oof. I've also been reliably informed as well, because I've been sat here doing fake tears and stuff, trying to whittle down a special defense. Doesn't, doesn't matter. Doesn't do anything. Um... Yeah. It, it, it's ba I, I've played Pokemon since the first game. I've always kind of assumed that reducing... I could fight it while I talk. I've always kind of assumed that... That's, no, no. That, like, if you reduce their stats, it will help you capture them. It does not, apparently. Basically, Pokemon have a capture rate, and then everything else is based on... You'll do. Everything else is based on how much HP it has and its status. So I can paralyze it, sleeping it. Uh, those both help towards it quite a lot. But yeah, reducing its defense doesn't do doesn't do anything. Does not do a single thing. So Filthy Dog's brilliant because Oh my do ghost moves not work on normal types? I thought they did. No, okay, I guess they don't. Right. I was going to say he's useful, because I know that he can only do 5 damage at a time. Okay, Bitey, tackle him then. We'll go, we'll do this the, uh, the old-fashioned way. But yeah, basically... No, no, growl! God damn it, why is tackle not top left? I need to move that. Ah, it bugs me that tackle is not in top left. Oh shit! Hang on, I don't. I've just, I've just noticed Bitey's health. Um, okay, Bitey, good job. Let's, let's swap you out. Striking Tangy. He's, he's got a bit more girth to him. He can take Taurus's rage. Here I am talking. I almost got Bitey killed. 
That would have been bad. Um, I mean, all right. I shouldn't do enough damage to kill it. No, good. Okay, that's pretty. That's only the orange. I think that's good enough. Um, let's try a heal ball, just so we've got some different balls on the overlay. Not that I'm going to use Taurus. Sorry, whoever gets this. I'm not going to use you in that, uh, unless I completely run out of Pokemon. Heal balls are freaking useless as well. I'm noticing this is a this is a trend here. I don't have anything. No. Uh, Oh, whatever. We'll use another one, because I, I bought them. We might as well. I know the point of heal balls is you're supposed to catch a Pokemon that you're intending to use at the time, but I just really like the different coloured Pokeballs. Hooray! Look at that. We caught the Taurus. There's a, there's a genuine enthusiastic hooray, and not at all me just... I mean, no, I don't give a shit. It's Taurus. Look at it. Look at this thing. Number 150. That's not your rank. You're not a Mewtwo. You'd be, I'd be happy if you were a Mewtwo. Uh, how about locking horns? Hmm. Okay. All right. Well, who gets the honour of being Taurus? Uh, let's go random generator and give me Santa. <laughs> oh, Santa, you have not had much luck in this run, have you? You were almost a legendary, but then I realised I'd set the set the picker up wrong. I then you were then an Aegon. Which was pretty good. You got immediately killed. And now you're a Taurus. Oh dear. Who, who knows? Maybe you'll be... Maybe you'll be... The sleeper star of this run through. But for now, you're in the box. And you're going to stay there until the foreseeable future. Right. I don't really have anything else to do here. I mean, I suppose I'll probably walk to the end just to see what's here. But yeah, I really just came here for... To see if there was Pokemon. What's this? Nothing. Okay. Let's save as well. Because we've already had the game glitch in the Ruins of Alf once already, so... There we go. Oh, another thing! I have also turned on... Or at least I should have turned on. By turning on, I mean I've changed the ROM to allow and enable me to um, use... Yeah, Fluffy Dog should have heard this one. Uh, I've enabled uh, Impossible Evolutions, which will basically allow me to evolve stuff that I could not otherwise evolve with one copy of the game, such as my starter Pokemon Geodude. He will now evolve into a Golem at some point. I think it's sort of around level 30-something, like the other ones. Yeah, this will work. Because, yeah, it was, I, it was one of those things I didn't even really think of. Because I, I just, I guess I just didn't assume that I'd get it. But there's quite a lot where you have to, like, I think, actually, Dusclops is, um, is also one that you have to trade whilst he's holding an item. So he will now, if I can find the item, probably should have written down what it was. But if I can get the item and give it to him, and then level him up, he will then evolve into, I want to say Dusk Noir? That sounds right. But yeah, uh, so it was it was important, I think, for this run that I had uh, Impossible Evolutions done on, just so I don't back myself into a corner where I'm trying to fight my trainer's golem with my Graveler. I mean, Graveler's a fine Pokemon, but he's no golem. Ooh, Ninjask. Uh, yeah, let's just try and level up. Level up Racker and Knit Filthy Dog. It's this seems to be a good a good switch at the moment. We've got to fight a gym lead. I'm going to run out of places to go that aren't the town that I've just ran through. And we're going to have to fight a gym leader in a bit. So I need to be... Well, I'm, let's just say I'm not going to fight the gym leader whilst I have three Pokemon that can't attack. Oh, I could swap one of them out for Taurus, who had Tackle. Uh, oh, no, he had Rage. Rage and Tail Whip. Uh, not going to do that. Apart from anything else, I think Rage isn't that great because I think once he starts using it, I have to... I can't, I can't really remember. It might be one where he gets stronger the more he's hit, or it's one where when I use, start using it, I can't take him out until Rage ends. It's one of those one of those kind of moves, and that's not... It's just not good for a Nuzlocke. Plus, it's a Taurus. I mean, fuck, it's a Taurus. I really don't have a very high opinion of Taurus. It's probably fine. They might, I might find out. I mean, it can, you know, surf. 
there is that. I mean, if I know, if I had that surf, uh, uh, that surf, if I had that HM, I'd absolutely teach it to it, and it'd be brilliant. But then I have compatibility turned on, so hey, look, Rackle under move. I think Flail is an attack, isn't it? Oh, that reminds me. All right, let's let's have a look at that. Racker, have you just learnt an attack? Look at that flail. Use a flail to vote aimlessly to attack. It becomes more powerful the less HP the user has. It's not a great move, because I don't really want to keep you on low HP. Uh, although you are protected against one-hit KOs. I didn't actually know. Oh, yeah, I should probably look at the abilities my Pokemon have as well. I forgot that was a thing. Okay, Racker now has an attack. Excellent. You are now more useful than Murphy and Martin. It's not, not much of an accomplishment, but hey-ho. Let's uh, switch you out for Martin then, because he doesn't. He needs to level up a little bit. Uh, also, let's there. Now, Ponyta has tackled in the right place, and I won't keep growling at shit. Alright, let's get out of here because we've 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 caught our Pokemon, and there's nothing to do here. There is a thing up there, but I don't know what that is. I'm pretty sure you come back here at some point, or you can come back here at some point, I don't know. Now that I've caught a Pokemon here, unless there's it forces me to, I don't really have a reason to. I can use Splash, excellent. Forgot about that, Splash. Awesome, okay. Uh, uh, oh, my Ian is Dark, is Dark good against Ghost? I really should bring, I put... I should, I've mentioned this a bunch of times, I should really put up like a type sheet, but it'd be quite tedious for me to just go, hang on, let me consult the chart. No, it's not. It's much more fun for me to guess, if less effective, because I, I get it wrong quite a lot. For all I know, Dark might be, and apart from that, it's level 5, it probably doesn't have any Dark moves. It's got Sound Attack and Tackle by the looks of things. Oh no, the bite, it does have one. It does have one, that's fine. I'm justified in my, uh... Wow, again, assuming the dark is effective against ghosts, because I can't remember. It might be, it might not be. Dark, steel, and fairy. Oh, I don't have to worry about fairy in this game, but dark, steel, and fairy, I still, I'm not, still not 100% on where those type advantages sort of lie, because I kind of more or less learnt the original 15, but then, I mean, they keep changing it. Look at that, Martin's level 4 now. Still no moves. Still useless. Alright. Let's go heal up real quick. And then, I think, actually, while I'm here... Is there anything else I can do here? Will it actually let me continue on through here? I can see an old guy looking across the way. Who I think is going... I'm just going to save just in case. Because again, this is a glitchy area. By virtue of the fact that it's glitched once. There's an old dude here. Who's uh, staring across the way. Me thinks he will stop me from progressing. Oh, no. No, he's just an old goo dude. I can get on a Route 32. Have I caught anything on Route 32? Where's my map? Uh, my Pokedex? No, why would it be my Pokedex? What am I talking about? Where's my map? It's my Poke Gear. Uh, right, so I started there. I've been to route 29, 46, 30, and 31. But not 32. Okay, we can catch a Pokemon here. Um, let's heal up slightly then. It's a bit of a waste of money healing. I could just... How are Pokes looking? I should be alright. It's just long grass. I can just... I'll just catch something then. I've got an Ultra Ball if something good comes up. Yeah, let's just catch something real quick and then we'll disappear. We won't uh, hang about. I'm just going to have a look. Oh, this leads back up into Violet City. Oh, look at that. Oh, Alright, we'll just heal then. Since we're here. Why not? Why not, I say. I didn't realise that looped round. Yes, I would like to rest my tired Pokemon. Oh, look at that. Six balls. I think I have been to a Pokemon Center with six balls before, but 
It's always nice. I don't know why I always talk to you, old man. There's just something about you. you. I've talked to you a bunch of times. And it's just every time you tell me the same thing. I don't know what I'm expecting from you. Every time he tells me about Team Wasp's face. I didn't talk to this dude. He's still over there. Um, did I get anything from in here? I can't remember. Oh yeah, I, I forgot to make my, my group. Hang on. This was important. There we go, the Jackers group. There we go, we couldn't have... I knew there was something that I missed that I, when I, when I, the game crashed. And I couldn't figure out what it, I couldn't remember what it was, and it was that. So good, the, the Jackers are still alive. We wouldn't want to go through the game without people knowing that we were a Jacker. A Yulu Apricorn. Could you just have written yellow? Would that have been too bad? Alright, um, all right, fair enough. Straight up, who we got? Ooh! A Torchic! Look at you! I mean, I already have a fire Pokemon, but you will be a good backup. Now, you are Psychic, so you're fine, but you don't have any moves, so... Do you know, I really want this Torchic, so I... Alright. I know. Uh, Bitey, you're fire, so you should be you should be good for this. And you're not too much higher level, so a tackle from you is not going to do too much damage. Again, it's a level four Torchic, so it's going to know tackle at best. But you know, it never oh, scratch, scratch the the attack that I affectionately in my head refer to as the other tackle. I don't know why they decided... Oh, people are bored of Tackle. We need another move. We need another move that basically serves the exact same purpose. And more or less has... Is exactly the same except for the name. Uh, Scratch! Yes. Yes. Write that down. That's good. Right. I really want you... Should I waste my Ultra Ball on it? No. We might, well, we'll save the Ultra Ball in case we get in a Legendary pop-up. We can catch a Torchic in a Pokeball, it's fine. Aesthetically, I would like my overlay to have lots of different coloured Pokeballs, rather than f currently five red Pokeballs and a Premier Ball. A Premier Ball. But at the same time, it's a bit of a waste of an Ultra Ball on a, on a wounded Torchic, when I can absolutely catch it in a regular Pokeball. I, I mean, I say that I can, but it, it's... It's giving me problems. No. Balls. Go. Fire. Get in the red ball. Come on, it's a red ball, Torchic. You like red? I mean, I know you're... Oh, come on, Torchic. Don't make me use an Ultra Ball on you. Just get in. You're being a proper Cubone right now. Damn it. I've got bag, balls, Pokeball, use. Wish there was a button for last action. You could just press that and it just do the exact same thing you did last round again. No, oh God, get in the ball! What is the catch rate on a Torchic? It must be low. Balls. Oh, actually, I think there is... Yeah, I can just use item last used. I still... It only saves you one click, really, because I still have to click yes to use it, but... Oh, fuck this. All right, Torchic, you're getting the Ultra Ball. Actually, I'll tell you what. First of all. I, I'm reluctant to use the Ultra Ball just because I don't get any for quite a while. So what I'll do, my attack's been lowered quite a lot. I should only be doing sort of about like one. I'll just knock him until he gets to red. Like, even if I get a critical, with, with how much he's lowered my attack, it's really... There we go. He's in red now. He's in red. That should... I should knock him down a tier. Again, I it's it's evident that I don't know how this works exactly. So I should, maybe I should hold B and up, which I think is space and W in this mode setup. Oh come on, you're in red now. Get in. Why? I really don't. I should use my heel ball on this dude. Get in. Get in and stay in. Stop it. Stop it. You, uh. Alright, fine. Ultra Ball on Torchic. It's clear that Pokeball is... It's, 
not going to work. If you break out of this, I'm fucked. Because I've only got three Pokeballs left and you don't seem to like those. Oh, you utter cunt! Come on! What the... You... Bastard! Alright. You're doing one damage. All right, we'll hit it one more time. It's gonna, it's gonna, it has to be on one HP at that point. No! Why? Why? No! You fucking horse! Oh, you... Balls! <laughs> that was a Torchic! It's a really good Pokemon! It's the first good Pokemon I've got! Sorry, the rest of you are shit! I mean, look at you, actually. F filthy Dog's okay. The rest of you are crap. I quite like Geodude, actually. But otherwise... God damn it, it was a Torchic! I wasted seven Pokeballs and an Ultra Ball on it! And then you killed it! <sighs> Fuck! <sighs> Alright, I'm going to save as well, just so that... There's no, there's no going back. I can't undo that mess. Ah, <sighs> all right. Uh, there's an old dude down here. Are you a trainer, or are you going to stop me from progressing? No right, passage for all trainers. Yeah. Okay. So he's going to stop me from progressing. I think there's what? Uh, damn it! I didn't mean to go through that. Okay, that's fine. We'll fight whatever comes up here. It's a graveler. Oh, it's a golem. Just an actual golem, okay. Well, it's a good thing that didn't come up, because I wouldn't have been able to catch that. Um, I don't know if I mentioned it in the rules, but yeah, no duplicates. So, and Geodude would count, and, and evolution duplicates count. Uh... Yeah, alright, filthy dog, go. Might as, well, might as well knock it out. Why not, eh? Why not? That's... Speed. Yes, it is speed. Okay, cool. Well, yeah. <laughs> really useful having a ghost Pokemon this early on, because it's just... And, it, I mean, it's going to be annoying once I get to the point where I don't need to level up anymore. But then, but at the time for now, whilst no, no one has any attacks that can hit ghosts, more or less, and most everyone has, like, normal bite and scratch and growl and whatever... Yeah, it makes, makes leveling a lot easier. So starter Pokemon must just have really high catch rates then, or low catch rates, however it works. Because, yeah, there's no way to explain why it took that many Pokemon. You could break out, like a level 4 wounded Torchic could break out of an Ultra Ball. That's... I mean, that's not good. Just for me. Because it means that I knock if I get any starter Pokemon, it's gonna be I'm in for a, a hard time, and I know I don't have any Ultra Balls. Um, there is where is it? I think it's over here. There's one more place I can go to catch Pokemon before the gym, and that is the tower here. Okay. Well, luckily for you, my mum did let me get a Poke Gear because my mum loves me. A lot. Oh yeah. You can headbutt trees and stuff comes out. I don't know if it's Pokemon or if it's items. But yeah, this is Sprout Tower. Pretty sure there are Pokemon in here. Well, I mean, that's very clearly not a Bell Sprout, is it? It's a piece of wood. Oh, whatever. Let's see what the Sprout Tower has. Ooh, a wonderful move, eh? I'm guessing it won't be, judging by the because <laughs> I've randomised it. I'm <laughs> here to learn Splash! Thanks, th thanks. Oh, it's a trainer, okay. Um, I kind of didn't think about that, but I was fine. I didn't find my champion, Zoe. Right, I mean, it's nice to meet you, Zoe. I didn't realise you'd be in a place like this. I mean, it looks like my Pokemon journey might be quite, quite short. I just beat this guy and I become the champion. So, oh no, it's not an official. It's not an official match. It doesn't count. It doesn't count. Like, oh, okay, champion Joey, Zoe, whatever your name is.
Oh. Yeah, okay, well, so we know that Dark's super effective against Ghost, I suppose. Um, that said, it's still not doing a great deal of damage against me. Uh, yeah, do you know what? It's not doing that much damage. I'll, I'll keep fighting. Apart from Gaz is a trainer, so he's probably going to use something else. Yeah. And I can kill him. So I was, I was, just, I was right about bite. I guess it is super effective against ghosts then. Bite with ghosts and psychic. I know it's super effective against psychic because it's the whole reason they introduced dark. Yes, I would like to switch my Pokemon to Raka, because Raka can now hit stuff. Because look at him, he's brilliant. <laughs> he's not, but <laughs> I mean, one day he'll be a pseudo Wudo, and those are okay. I think. Does he become a pseudo Wudo? Actually, I don't know. Pseudo Wudo is steel and Rack is stone, so maybe he doesn't. What the hell does What the hell does Bonsley evolve into? Does Bonsley even evolve? I mean, I guess we'll find out, providing he lives long enough to tell the tale. Does he just go? Oh no, no, he does have it. Oh, and he's got a grass attack as well. That's not. That's that's a problem. Uh, oh, hang on. Is is Rack a ground? Well, whatever. Let's just keep flailing. God, he's got a lot of moves, this ninja. This ninja ask. Like, if he's got a full set of four moves. I mean, four of them are stats moves, but... Uh, three of them are stats moves, but... Yeah, Leech Life Grass, isn't it? But it's not super effective against me. I thought Raka was rock. Hmm. Maybe, maybe it's not. Maybe Leech Life isn't grass move. Maybe it's a poison move. Maybe I'm thinking of Leech Seed. Yeah, it's, it's, I mean, it's, it's great that you're raising your speed. I don't care. I'm going to keep flailing at you. And the more damage you do, the stronger that move gets as well. Yeah, I read the description. God, I'm just going to critical and get this over with. Because you've only got seven mo use of this moves yet. Seven uses of this move left. I can talk, I promise. Oh, this is exciting. This is an exciting fight. I mean, I suppose it's, I, I want these fights to last for a little while longer, because it's when they start getting into the one-hit-kill fights, that's, that's when shit dies. Mostly, mo mostly my shit. There you go, that was a nice flail. Racker, come on, flail it to death. Hit it with your little green balls. Excellent job. Oh, hey! Bagon. I kind of remember what that is, but I don't remember what it is. Um. But let's... Alright, Murphy, I'm going to send you out. And then I'll switch you back out again, because you um, can't do anything. I appreciate your enthusiasm, though. It's a dragon Pokemon. That's fine. Um, Filth's a bit wounded. Did I just send out, actually? Um... I'll send Filth back out. It should be fine. Unless he's got Bite. But he's level 3, so even if he has Bite, it shouldn't... There we go, Rage. Excellent. Yep, if Rage is all it can do, then it can't do anything. And... Nightshade. Bye, Bagon. I don't know what this trainer's type was. It had two dragon Pokemon and then a ninja ask, which is... Maybe it's flying? But then... Oh, I don't know. Uh, let's save. 
I should, I should save off the trainer battles as well because I had to redo one of those trainer battles. That the the last trainer battle of the last video, I think, because again, glitching. And there's a lot of different areas here. Uh, how's me how's me pokes looking? That's my bag. I don't care about my bag. How's me pokes looking? I mean, not too bad. I suppose I. I don't want to be too. Uh, okay, well we're. we're... We're early on. Let's go and heal. I, I don't, I don't want to be too sort of paranoid and constantly going back and re healing, but at the same time, I don't want to be so reckless that I get everyone killed just for something like really, really avoidable. Like if I'd just gone back and rested one more time, it would have been fine. And because I was just like, no, nah, we'll fight, we'll fight the last trainer. Which is absolutely how I can see this run ending. Because, I mean, well, the first one wasn't really my fault. I hadn't had no choice against that dude. Because he's my rival. Uh, and he just obliterated me. But the second time, I could have run away. Mm, possibly. From that, um... Uh, legendary? Can't remember his name. Big whale. Big blue whale dude. Not Rhydon. Why is Rhydon the name that I'm thinking of? And not Surviper either. These are neither of these are the names. Why is my brain not working properly? Hey ho! Look, it's a Pokemon. Ooh, it's a Trapinch. Is that water? That's might be Bug. Hmm. Either way, um, yeah, Phil's useful for catching stuff. If it can hit, that is. If it can hit, it's useful. Ah, right. Never mind. Um, fine. Tangy, go. Oh, actually, Raku would have been alright for this. Well, whatever. I'm not killing it. Mm, well, I'm not intending to kill it. Yeah, that'll do. Alright. Uh, and I didn't buy any more Pokeballs, so I've only got three attempts at this. So let's go! Trap Inch! In the ball! Catch! One go! One shot! One kill! Oh, see, why... Now, Torchic, why couldn't you do that? Why couldn't you be nice, like Trap Inch, and just get in the fucking ball on the first attempt, alright? Then I wouldn't have had to kill you, and you're a ground Pokemon. Shit. Okay, well, I've got a backup for Cubone. That is your role now. You are, you are Cubone's backup. Uh, oh, it's a um, Antlion. It's nested as a slope ball like Pit in the Desert when something has fallen, and there's no escape. Okay, yeah, Ant Pit Pokemon. Right. Pretty sure an ant lion is a is an insect though. So sure it should be ground insect. Maybe it evolves into a ground insect. Yes, I would like to give a nickname to the court trap inch. What shall I call you, trap inch? You should be called Randymon. Named after my good friend Peter, the randiest man in the whole damn town. And now he has the randiest mon in the whole damn ton. Whatever. Randy Mon. Oh, I'm getting a I'm getting a call from Joey. Hi Jack Man. Hi Joey. Were you awake? Yes. Oh yeah, it says yeah, it's nine o'clock it's eight ten o'clock on a Saturday. Sableye! Where it goes, I'm not very good at catching Pokemon. And he just hangs up. It's like, alright, Joey. Why did I give this kid my number? Who is Joey? Don't really remember. If I'm honest. Oh. Right. Right. Hang on. It's gone. It's gone bad. It's gone very bad. It's gonna crash. It's gonna crash. I didn't save after capital it catching. Uh, fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Why is this game so glitchy? Why did no one tell me this game was so glitchy? More to the point. Okay, just punch it and hope that it dies before it can do anything. Oh, okay, no splash! Excellent! Although, fairness, a Magikarp using splash, harmless. A Waylord losing splash, cities fall. Like, you have to... Yeah, it's a different... Really, that should do damage. I'm quite happy that it doesn't, but it should.